is up YouTube. This is Lord Tom Bombing and now I'm bound against Aston 101. Let's play. And his bigger threats are the Sandman, Metagross, and Yuju. Those are the three main ones I am fearing at this point, but hopefully my strategy will have its toll on him. Now then, let's get this battle started. I said that we let the right and strapped to he sends out Sanamas and then charge on. Obviously, Sanamas and Stratus and Terminates are going off. Now, I went for U-turn because I didn't want to... S I just want to switch out and get some extra damage. And I thought I'd just go for Charizard because that is... Really, because my Electro and Cavalry's Ice Punch is four times effective against Sanamas. Now, switch out and send out the send out. That I decided to send out four. Then he goes to... And Charles are going for Heat Wave! And uh, both take it. Um, yeah, they gave some health back thanks to his, his Citrus Bay. And Charles are going the Life Orb. No, oh, really big deal. And he goes for Lock, so that's easy to unfortunately take out Zapdos. And let's fire, still is hanging there. But can anyone guess what happens? Oh, of course, I get bloody hell flinched! Now I send him back out! Raptor. So now that Sandman's has intimidated twice. Now my Raptor goes for the brief mood and takes out Charizard, which is great. Now that is down, and now he decides to set up a Dragon Dance. He can now speed everything and well, get his attacker because he was minus two. Now let's try and go for that nice punch. And even though it's four times effective, it's not going to take it out because this is not the electrifier. This is my follow me one. I was hoping he'll, you know, fall for, for it, for whatever. Uh, unfortunately he doesn't. Now he goes for Psychic and then we'll see since that's follow me. That's going to easily, unfortunately, to take out here at the wire. But that's my plan anyway. Now he's on a goose with that Dragon Claw but he's at minus one. And Strapton managed to hang out on just. Now Strapton goes for that Brave Burn on you too. And gets a crit. Uh, well, I guess that makes up for the flinch earlier with the Electrofire, because Electrofire probably would have taken out that Sandman's by now, but never mind. Now I decided to send out Sizzle, also known as the Claw, and he sends out Metal Growls. And my next Metal I'm going to send out is Growlithe. Obviously now that Sandman's is back to minus two, and it doesn't affect that um, Metagross. Damage clear body ability. No, the claw just goes with that body punch to take out that Sandman, so he doesn't do the rock slice shenanigans with my Arcanine. Cause that's the last thing I need. Now Growlithe of course for that flare blitz. And I was predicting actually thought, yeah, he's probably got that fire all. Whatever it is, you know, that increases the power of fire type moves. But still does a decent chunk. But now he goes for Earthquake! And he gets a bloody crit and Growler. Which I'm like, if one of, the, one of my two Pokemon had to get a crit, I'm actually glad it was Growler for not Sizzle. Anyway, I sent out my last Pokemon. Fly 8th Infamate. And he sends out Sceptile. And then straight away he calls it back. Probably he didn't mean to send it out or something. And now he's going to send these other last Pokemon. That push. No sizzle. Goes for that bullet punch. On that push. It was aiming for that set tie obviously. Because I know set tie was a very fragile. Maybe a technician banded bullet punch would have taken it out. But now in fact it goes for that heat wave. And that's easy to take out that Mega Sound since it's lost its 
or whichever area I think it's called, and it does a decent chunk to that Lapras. And even the didn't switch out, I still have, I still carry focus last time. Probably could have KO'd it. Now the claw goes for that bullet punch. And takes out the Lapras! And then the set time goes for that focus blast. And that's easy gonna take out the claw. But unfortunately for him, he's not gonna sign a heat wide from by a then for me. And that will be the game. And remember people of YouTube, go and subscribe to Aston 101 Let's Play's channel. Post a comment, a like, a rate, whatever. Peace out everyone.